Now that we've done the general screening for light and sharp touch, there's one other sense we should test, which is vibration sense. So Lindsay, what I want you to tell me is if you can feel the vibration and when it stops, okay? So, can you feel that? Mm -hmm. And then tell me when it stops. Stopped. Okay. Can you feel that? Yeah. And once again, let me know when it stops. No. Okay, great. Now we'll be moving on to joint position sense, known as proprioception. So for this one, Lindsay, I'm just gonna demonstrate a few movements so you understand what we're doing. Okay, this is up and that's down, okay? Mm -hmm. So one thing to note here is when you are testing this, you don't wanna be holding the top of the nail or bottom of the toe because that pressure will actually kind of give a hint or guide the patient in terms of which direction you're moving. So you wanna stabilize from the sides of the phalanx and the sides of the lower part of the toe. Okay, now you tell me which direction, okay? Down. Okay. Up. Up. Down. Perfect, good. Now, once again, we would be doing this on both sides. And the last part of the lower extremity neurological examination is a coordination test. So for this one, first off, we're gonna do a heel to shin test. So Lindsay, I'll demonstrate here. I want you to, you're gonna bend your knee, you're gonna bring the leg over, and then run your heel down the length of your shin. Come back, and then back up, and continue that cycle, okay? For a number of times. Okay, ready? Do you get it? So let's go, so bring that up. Perfect, yeah, and keep doing that. So we're looking for general coordination here. Good, just do it maybe a couple more times. Good, and last one. Perfect, okay. Now, same idea on this side. So once again, you're gonna bring the leg up like this, run the shin down the length, uh, sorry, the heel down the length of your shin, and then come back and do it in a nice cycle, okay? Okay, ready? So let's do that again. Good, yeah, and a few more times. So if someone were unable to do this, it could be indicative of like a cerebellar disorder, of the cerebellum, it could be um, weakness in the muscles of the lower leg or even maybe a problem with their sense of proprioception. So that's one thing to monitor for. Good, perfect, good, and relax. And now, last part, another coordination test is the tapping test. So you're going to basically tap my hands with your feet and keep going as fast as you can and try to coordinate the movement on both sides. There you go, good, yeah, tap. There, keep going. Okay, good, perfect. Okay, mm. and that concludes the lower extremity examination.